Talking about thinking, but I think maybe a better word would be sapiens. And then my question would be, would learned machines be capable of sapiens and sentience? Is that something that they could eventually get to? OK, um, I, here's my point of view on this. That is fundamentally a religious question. Because when we worry about it in all of these shows, humans, Westworld, I mean, just in, in all, the whole all the whole science fiction genre about AI is always about the same thing. Is that a machine, or is it, has it come alive and become conscious? And really what the question is, is do we owe it the courtesy of our empathy? It's a machine that behaves in a certain way. But whether you think that means we have an obligation to it, in the same way that we might have an obligation to hire animals, is, is really what these things are about. Those of you watching Westworld, that's the issue that they're dealing with. Like, should, is, is it stupid to be worrying about these machines? Uh, or is it a moral obligation that we have? So uh, here's the thing. We have no idea what that means. We have no idea what human sentience means. We have no idea what human uh, consciousness means. And this has been debated for centuries. And we haven't made any serious progress on those issues. It may turn out that we're just m machines made of meat. And then we have a decision to make. Now we're going to build something new, and, and it behaves. and you know. But I'm not really worried about robots coming in and you know, buying up all the prime real estate in Manhattan and drinking all the fine wine and all of that, that kind of thing. So to me, it's a religious issue more than anything else. Do we think there is such a thing as a human soul? And is there any notion of that being part of a machine? And there are two different schools of thought here in the United States. In Japan, interestingly enough, um, many people believe that all physical objects have a spirit. And so they have a very different view on, on this issue. And they respect robots and machines in ways that, that we don't hear. So I don't know the answer, because I don't know whether what human sentience means. And it's really the operational question. Should we be worrying about whether uh, a machine's feelings? You know, does a machine have a right to do anything? And that's really the fundamental issue.